What's up guys, Sahab Man back with another Metal Diecast Jada Toys figure review. Today we're going to be taking a look at the 124 inch scale diecast Batmobile with a diecast Batman figure. Now this is based off of the Dark Knight, the Tumblr off of Christopher Nolan's Dark Knight trilogy. Now I did pick these up from at paulmartstore.com. If you guys want to get this, you guys can use my discount code. That's Seha20, C-E-J-A 20. It'll save you 20% off of your purchase. Just go into the, uh, the link in the description and just type in the code at checkout. If not, if you're at Frankenstein's, if you guys know where Paul's booth is at, he sells a bunch of metal diecast figures. If you let him know, say how man sent you, he will give you 20% off of your purchase. Now, I've already reviewed the 124 inch scale 89 Batman with the Batman uh, diecast figure, and it is awesome. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have already seen the video, but now we have the Tumblr based off of the Christopher Nolan trilogy, the Christian Bale version. So it says here the Dark Knight, Batmobile, and Batman. So you got the really nice open um, window, and right here on the side, you got another window right here, and you can see the Tumblr, which looks amazing. Right there on the back, the other figures available. Now we have the uh, Batman versus Superman one with the diecast figure, so I'm wondering if it's going to be a little different compared to the one that was already released, but I'm pretty sure it'll probably be the same. We have the classic TV series Batman which I need to review and there's the 89 Batman which I already did a review on so that's it for the packaging on this you know again it's the same as all the other ones got the big open window on the front so you can see the figure let's take a quick break let's take this out and take a closer look at the tumble metal die cast mini batman figure now he does have a rubber cape so that's the only thing that's rubber on him other than that the outfit and the figure itself is all die cast now there is no articulation on this guy that's one thing i think that would make this figure pop more this set pop more is if he could have a little bit of articulation so you can fit the figure inside of the batmobile now you can take a look at the outfit which looks really good it's got nice little sculpting on it the belt looks to be a little bit on the lopsided side but not too big of a deal. Um, they didn't put the gauntlets on him. The little spikes on the gloves. And you can see the armor. The utility belt looks great. The head sculpt is a little bit off. It kind of looks like the it's, it's a little unproportioned in like the cheek area and the chin area. But it still looks cool. I don't like how you can see the uh, the description, like the, the little, the little um, number item number right there in the back. But other than that, it's a really cool little figure that just, just needs articulation to make this guy a lot better. All right, so here we have the Tumbler. Now, this thing is cold, again, because it is metal die cast. It's got these rubber wheels, which are very nice. You guys can get a close-up on the actual wheels here. So look at these back ones right here. See the treads on them? Very, very nice. I love this right here. And they, um, let's see, are they separate? Yeah, they are. So you can move these ones, and then you can move uh, these ones right here, and they're all connected. Very, very cool. You have the uh, the back right here, which looks awesome. This rotates right here. I was gonna say maybe this pops out or something, but no, this can actually rotate. And then you have like all the pistons and everything. It just makes this thing look cool. I mean, look at the cool little detailing on this. Very, very nice. Now, another cool thing is the canopy it does open. You can see the windows inside, but for, to open this up, you just pop this sucker open just like that. So it is pretty movie accurate the way it opens up. And then it is a two-seater, so you can see right inside the seats, a little bit of a detailing in there not too much but still looks good for what it is um, these little parts right here are plastic so just be careful where you place this so it doesn't fall or you know don't rip them off or anything um, because this does roll so if you're playing, placing it somewhere slanted you know this obviously could fall off but this is just a beautiful piece guys it's going to be for any any Batman collector you're definitely going to want this in your collection it's just so so nice Look at the back. The back is something I love the most about this. I just think this is awesome. And then you can see the rims right here. So just a fantastic piece. So here he is sitting by side next to the tumbler. So you can see it is in scale with the Batman figure. It's not like too big for the, the actual Batmobile. It is in scale. Here, so you can see this actually rolls very, very nicely. So let's go ahead and do some comparisons now. All right, so what you're looking at here is the metal diecast Jada Toys Batmobiles. We got the Batman versus Superman here, the 89 Batmobile, which is so awesome. And then we have the Tumblr, which we're taking a look at right here. Now, these are 124 inch scale, guys. They are going to make a smaller one um, of the Tumblr. 
a smaller scale and the same with the BVS one. They already did one of the Batmobile and the classic TV series Batman, which I'm gonna do a review on soon. But here's three, all three of them side by side. So here is a quick shot of all three of the Batmobiles and with the canopies open, so you can see they all open up and you can see inside of the driver's seat. Here's a look at both die cast figures from the Michael Keaton 89 Batman and the Christian Bale Batman. The 89 Keaton Batman looks way, way better, but um, there's a little comparison right there. You have it, guys. There's my review. Today we're taking a look at the Metal Diecast Jada Toys 124 inch scale tumbler from Batman to Batman Begins or the Dark Knight, you know, the Dark Knight trilogy, Christian Bale Batman. Now, this is a fantastic piece, guys. I'm really loving what Jade is doing with these. I'm, I'm, I hope, I hope we get more Batman vehicles. Again, I would like to see the Batman Forever, Batman and Robin. Give us Batman the Animated Series. Give us the Batwing. I think it would just look awesome. Uh, give us some more vehicles, uh, Jada Toys. If you guys watch this, please give this video a thumbs up. Now, if you guys want to pick up any of these metal diecast Jada Toys figures, again, palmartstore.com. Click in the link in the description. Use Seha20 to save 20% off of your purchase, guys, for any of the metal diecast Jada Toys. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you guys soon. Stay tuned for more videos on the way. Peace.